hey there everyone welcome or welcome back to my channel i'm miriam i'm excited to show you in today's video how i set up an easter tablescape using pops of color with everything easter and spring i'll be using some items that i have on hand and some other items i got from the local stores around me to set up a fun and festive table so stay tuned so after i wiped on my table um i went ahead to throw on this gorgeous lemon green table runner and when i think of easter or spring i uh, i mean you can't go wrong with this beautiful lemon green and i think it brings light and refreshment to the dining table and i love it then i have this egg garland with bunch of colorful berries i think it's fun and it'll bring character to the table Next is the round woven placement mat. Let me tell you how beautiful this placement mat looks. Um, I got this from Amazon and I couldn't think of another beautiful color. This is bright yellow and look how gorgeous it goes with the table. Up next is my gold reef charger plate. I love how it complements the black background of my dining table. Such a statement piece. I've had this for a long time. After that, I went ahead and put my classic white plate. I love white plates because they go with anything on the dining table. I mean, literally everything. They are like the black dress of your dining table. Trust me. Up next is my aqua blue napkin. This color is gorgeous. So I'm just going to go ahead and demonstrate um, how I folded the napkin. So you're just going to fold it in half into a triangular shape and then um, roll it. Basically, I'm trying to achieve the Easter bunny uh, ear with this napkin. I'm sure you must have seen a lot of people replicate this look lately. So you just, you know, basically roll it. Some people roll it, some people fold it. Um, either way, you are achieving the same look. But just make sure that they're, they're equal when you line it up and just straighten it and after that i'm using my organza uh, ribbon that i've had from before to make a bow and that's simple and that's it it's beautiful and there goes my easter egg so this beautiful neutral color eggs i just had to place them in the middle of the bunny ear napkin and after that is my cutlery i've had this from before so i'm just reusing this uh, you know the drill, the fork goes on the left hand side, the knife and the spoon goes on the right side. Uh, make sure your knife is facing the dish, that way, you know, it's simple for your guests to just pick it up and go on and eat. So that's it. the glasses the drinking glasses my table for easter uh i'm sharing wine and water so i'm using two glasses one for each uh it's totally up to you some people use one some people use two depending on what you're serving so i'm just gonna go ahead and place um, um both glasses next to each guest and that's um how i do it And this part I'm so excited about my lights. I have this new lamp that I got from the local store around me uh, and I have my candles at home so I didn't need to buy a new candle so I'm just going to go ahead and pop in my candle and turn it on and for the candle stands oh the gorgeous candle stand look at that I got this from Amazon and these candles are battery run and they're real wax 
candle wax so I just went ahead and look at that turn it on and that's it that's all you need battery it's just so beautiful it looks very realistic I'm, I'm afraid not that I'm afraid but I, you know I have little children so I'm really careful the reason why I use the you know battery lights so very often when I do my tablescape it's for this reason you don't want accident on a table for me that's just for now it's safe where you have children so I just went ahead and placed each beautiful uh, teal green it's like a, is that teal or oh, I think it's a, a dark I'll say olive green or butter green and next is the bunnies you cannot decorate Easter or spring tablescape without adding your bunnies so I got this from the local stores the store is called um, home bagging if you live anywhere in the UK yes that's a store so um, they didn't have the ribbons I went ahead and you know uh, attached the ribbons I tied the ribbons on the bunnies around the bunny's neck and that's it and just add it to the table my candy jar oh better still i say sweet jar and um i'm pretty much done i'm just gonna go ahead and straighten things out and that's it for this video guys um i've wrapped it up i hope that this video has inspired you i hope that you found it very informative or in some way you know giving you inspiration to do your table um in any case just let me know in the comment section uh, let's see how you decorated your table and i'm so glad that you stayed from the beginning to the end of this video thank you thank you so much and i cannot wait to share my next video with you bye now